What's up everybody, it's Cody here from Tidewee. Today I wanted to take a second of your time to talk about the new heated clothing that Tidewee's been coming out with the last couple of months. The heated clothing has been a very popular line of ours here at Tidewee, and we've been getting a lot of questions on how exactly we use or to use the heated clothing that we've been coming out with. Today I'm gonna walk everyone through the heated bibs that Tidewee just came out with a few weeks ago. These heated bibs are complemented by a heated jacket, but I will go through that heated jacket in a separate video. So we're gonna go ahead and talk about the bibs today. There are gonna be two styles of bibs that I'm gonna show you guys in this video. One style is a camouflage style bib that is used for hunting. Um, and then we have another style bib that is like a black and gray style bib that will be used for mostly fishing. Now there's many other uses for these bibs. Maybe you guys are purchasing them for work. Maybe you're purchasing them for hiking, camping, whatever it may be. There's gonna be multiple uses for these bibs. And I wanna be sure when you guys get out there in the woods, on the boat, uh, camping, whatever it may be, that you guys know how to use this clothing the right way. Right away, we're gonna talk about the battery that's gonna come with these heated products. You're gonna get a battery with the heated bibs. You're gonna get a battery with the heated jacket. The box is actually gonna look a lot like this. What this battery actually is, is a lithium 10,000 amp hour battery. This battery is going to come with the heated jacket and this battery is also going to come with the heated bibs. When you take this battery out of the package, it's going to look a lot like this. It's a very simple puck design battery. The cool thing about this battery is it actually has a digital display instilled on the front of it. Thus letting you know if you have to charge it or get that thing ready to go for the next morning. On the front of the battery pack, you're going to notice we have two USB outlets. Uh, that is going to be where we plug the heated clothing into the battery pack itself uh, for it to work. On the other side of the battery, you're going to see two charging ports. One's going to be a type C charging port, and then the other one is going to be that micro uh, standard charging port that comes with pretty much every battery pack that you'd ever purchase. So now that we talked a little bit about the battery itself, we're going to go ahead and throw this into the clothing that we have here uh, and show you exactly how to operate this clothing once the battery is installed. So looking straight at the bibs, the pocket that the battery is gonna go into is actually on the right hand side. If you were wearing the bibs, this would be the left hand side thigh pocket. It's located right here. Inside that pocket, you're gonna find a little cord with a USB outlet on the tip of it. This is where you're gonna plug that battery pack into that USB output. Once that battery pack is installed, you're gonna see those digital numbers pop up. That's basically gonna let you know that the battery's on and it's ready to work. Please note that we do have a safety feature on these batteries. So as soon as that digital display turns off, the battery is actually not functional. Um, you always need to make sure that you hit that button um, to illuminate those numbers. When those numbers are illuminated, the bibs are ready to be heated. So now that our display is illuminated, this battery pack is ready to go and these bibs are ready to be heated. What we're gonna do is just shove that battery pack right back into the pocket and zip that pocket up so everything is nice, safe, and sound. Um, you're not gonna lose that battery. It's zipped inside the pocket. Everything will be good to go. Now, because this is a pair of hunting bibs, we wanted to make sure that we were hiding the element button uh, beneath a pocket just to be sure that that button isn't glowing uh, while you're trying to hunt, while you're walking into the woods, whatever it may be, we wanted to make sure that it was hidden behind a pocket uh, so that it isn't visible to the game that you're hunting. So looking at the bibs, that button is actually gonna be located on the right-hand side, if you were wearing it, the left-hand side of the chest. Um, so we have two pockets on each side of the bibs. If you look on that left-hand side, you're gonna expose the button that will actually control the elements inside the bibs. Now to turn the elements on, it's simple. We're basically gonna push that button and hold it until that button illuminates red. As soon as that button is illuminated red, these bibs are now heating on the high setting. On this high setting, you'll get about three hours of battery life uh, with the pack that we have installed with the bibs. To adjust the setting of the heating elements is also very simple. By tapping the button once, you'll see that it illuminates to a white setting. This white setting is gonna let you know that it's heating on a medium setting. On the medium setting, you can get about five and a half hours uh, of battery life out of the pack that we have included with the bibs. To adjust this to a low setting, we'll simply just click the button one more time to illuminate a blue color. This is the lowest possible setting that you can adjust the heating elements to. On this low setting, you can get about 10 hours of battery life with the battery pack that we have included with the bibs. To shut the bibs off is also very simple. All we're gonna do is click and hold that button once again until the light turns off. As soon as that light turns off, the bibs are no longer going to be heating. Now that we have talked about Tidewee's camouflage heated pair of bibs, we're going to go ahead and talk about the gray and black style pair of bibs. Here is the gray and black style pair of heated bibs that Tidewee has to offer. As you can tell, you can already see the 
heating element button at the top of the bibs. Because this pair of bibs isn't actually going to be used for the sport of hunting, we went ahead and made sure that that heating element button is very, very visible. Once again, this pair of bibs is gonna work the exact same way as the pair of camouflage bibs that we just went through, uh, just the button placement is a little different. So once again, on the left-hand side of the pair of bibs, uh, the left thigh pocket here, you're gonna find that USB outlet that we're gonna connect to the battery. Once again, as you can tell, uh, that digital display is going to illuminate, letting you know that the battery's ready and the bibs are now ready to be heated. So just like the camouflage pair of bibs, to start heating these bibs, we're basically gonna push the button and hold it until it illuminates red. Now that the button is illuminated red, these bibs are now heating on that high setting. That high setting will heat these bibs up to 130 degrees uh, with a safety stop that will automatically bump it down if it does get too warm. And on this high setting, your battery will last about three hours. To adjust this to a medium heating setting, we're simply just gonna click the button until it illuminates white. By clicking it once, you see the white has illuminated, letting us know that these bibs are now heating on a medium setting. On this medium setting with the battery we have included with the bibs, you'll get about five and a half hours of working time. Finally, to adjust this to a low setting, we're gonna click the button one more time to give it that illuminated blue color. Now that the button is illuminated blue, these bibs are now heating on the lowest setting possible. On this low setting, with the battery we have included with the bibs, you can get about 10 hours of working life out of it. And once again, to turn these bibs off, we're simply just gonna push the button and hold it just like we did to turn them on until that light turns off. Within three seconds, the bibs are now no longer heating. Well, that is how you use Tywee's brand new heated bibs. Once again, we have them available in camouflage and that black and gray style. If you are interested in learning more about the Tidewe heated bibs, you can check them out on our website at www.tidewe.com. They are also made available on amazon.com as well. Once again, I hope this helped you get a better understanding on how to use our heated clothing. I'll be doing more reviews on the heated clothing that we have here at Tidewe very soon. We have a brand new three-in-one heated jacket that we'll be talking about next time, a heated vest, an original heated jacket and heated gloves. All of these items will have reviews very, very soon so you guys can understand how to use it properly when you're out in the outdoors. Once again, my name is Cody from Tidewee. Hopefully this video helped you. If it did, please leave a comment down below and don't forget to smash that subscribe button for more product review videos like this. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.